Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Sally and I'm the Chief Marketing Officer here at McCart. Today I've got something super exciting. So on the Your Nail Lab Instagram, last week I posted up a little challenge where I asked you guys to challenge me so that I can recreate one of your sets. And Mrs. Barrio sent us a submission of a set that she did with our Your Nail Lab boxes. And I was like, oh my gosh, I love it so much. We have to create this. So today I'm gonna to try to recreate the nails that she created and we'll see how this goes. Let's get started. Okay, so to get started, I'm starting out with some clear tips first. It looks like from her photo, she's using the XXL Ballerina tips. So that's basically what I'm using today. Um, I'm measuring them out and then I'm gonna go in with my first layer, which is my base coat. This will make sure that my nails do stay on. And yeah, we're basically just gonna go in with the poly gel. So from her instructions, I'm supposed to use the A Siesta poly gel as well as the clear poly gel. And so that's what I'm doing today. With my brush dipped in some slip solution, um, I'm going in to just pat everything in. And then halfway through, I realized that I didn't have enough because these are XXL tips and you need a lot of poly gel. Really great start here, you guys. Um, but anyway, now that I have all of my poly gel kind of tapped into place, um, I'm putting that directly onto my nail as if it were some press-ons. And I'm gonna get started on my second nail. So it looks like from her photo, the thumb as well as the, um, the pointer finger, they're both a nude. And so I'm just gonna do that for both of them. Um, this part is pretty easy. I'm a little bit afraid of the middle finger and the ring finger because it looks like she's got like a clear French and I'm not that good at doing this. So we'll see how it goes. But my thought process on this is that I would create kind of like the base of the nail first with the A Siesta poly gel and then without curing it, I'm gonna go in with the clear and then we'll kind of see how this works. There is a chance that it's gonna mess everything up, um, which by the way, you guys, some PTS on this, it did, it completely messed up, so I did have to do this um, twice. Now that I've got my middle finger on here um, and it looks pretty good, I'm basically just gonna go ahead and finish off the other nails off camera. So to get all the rhinestones in place, I am using the rhinestone glue from Macari. This is my favorite glue. Um, and since looking at the picture that she sent me, there is a lot of rhinestones on this. I'm kind of nervous that I'm not gonna get them all in the right place. Um, but this is why the rhinestone glue is amazing because I can then kind of place everything down first and then cure it and I can always adjust before curing it. And that just makes the entire process so much more simple. So unfortunately, I did not have all of the same exact rhinestones that she had. It looks like she's using a lot of like you know, like AB rhinestones. I didn't have all of the shapes, so I'm kind of doing my best here. I am really glad that I found this like heart shaped in our rhinestone kit and this worked out pretty well. Um, everything doesn't look exactly the same, so it's more like a recreation, but like sort of not really, I don't know. We'll see, but anyway, I'm going in with the top coat to smooth everything down. I did not have to put any top coat on the actual rhinestone since the rhinestone glue is so strong. And that's pretty much the final look. I hope you guys like this set. I don't know, I kind of like it. Okay, you guys, I'm finished with the final nail. Look at how cute that is. I'm so obsessed. I don't think I've had so much fun doing my nails in such a long time. Like, this is a really, really extra set for me. And I don't know, I feel like I'm loving it. And I feel like for the next couple days, I'm gonna go around and like talk to everybody with my fingers because I just wanna show these off. Woo, look at that. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I personally had so much fun doing this video. I think I might make this a thing. Um, if you guys wanna challenge me and have me, I don't know, recreate one of your sets, definitely let me know. Tag us at McCart Official or tag us at Your Nail Lab. And I don't know, maybe I'll do another one of these soon. I'm kind of obsessed. I have to say like her designs, so intricate, could not do it. But you know what I mean? Like I'm still loving it. I did, you know, kind of the best that I could. And even though it doesn't look as good as hers, I feel like I'm kind of loving it too. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys like watching videos like this, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and comment below if there's a particular look that you guys want me to recreate. Bye! Or bye!